it's me again, Anushka, your best friend, I know. As you can tell from the title, today we're going to be talking about bronzers, my top five bronzers, and you guys know I cannot live without my bronzer and my mascara. Maybe I should do a mascara one. Before we jump onto that, I want to tell you guys how to be a bit more of a shopping expert when you shop online, like myself, obviously. No, I'm joking. I obviously shop a lot online, whether it's makeup, clothes, skincare, anything. I just do it most of the time online because I don't have time, you know, to go out and do shopping. It just happens very rarely. So, I literally have, like, my best shopping friend online, which is Shoptega. Thank you so much to Shoptega for partnering with me on this video. Um, but basically, they're, your, they're gonna be your best friend while shopping. All you have to do, basically, is Download the Shoptaker button on your browser. Once you've downloaded the Shoptaker button to your browser, you can then choose from a bunch of websites, either on from their website or you can go and Google, search your favorite website, Misguided for example, and then you can choose an item that you're interested in and let's say you're not too sure about it and you wanna think about it, you can save it to a wish list using the shop taker button that pops out in the corner. You can customize your wish list, you can create different ones, so I have like, like three different ones. I have some for my skincare, my makeup, clothes. You can then customize your push notification option. So whether if there's a sale, a 50% sale on the item, then you'll get notified by, via email or through your phone if there is a change in the price of the item. Or you could just save it overall and anything that happens on the item, whether it comes back in stock or um, there's, a, there's a sale on it, you'll be notified, which is amazing. You don't have to just keep going back and checking and a lot of times I buy things and two weeks later it's on sale. What I do like about the wish list and being able to organize them is that you can easily find specific items that you want to go check back on and you know it's just really convenient. They also do have a new feature which to be honest my personal favorite is every time you go to a checkout the shop taker button will pop out and it will say that it's found some coupons that it, wanted to, it wants to try for you and it will just run all the coupon codes on the internet for that that website. Um, and a lot of times it does save me a lot of money and you don't have to go on Google and search coupon codes for X, Y, and Z. And then a lot of them don't work in the end. This does the job for you and it's so quick. I refuse, I refuse to do online shopping without my shop taker button in my browser because I know I'll be missing out on the chance of you know, saving some coin. And let's say you don't shop on your laptop a lot or on your computer, you can also download the Shoptega app and it will help you on your mobile phone as well. So we got everyone covered. So yeah, if you guys wanna be a bit more organized with your shopping and have the chance to save some money, you can check the link down below to download Shoptega. Honestly, you will thank me later. Um, you'll thank me later, okay, don't worry. Don't worry, I got you, I got you. And obviously, I don't get student discount no more, so wherever I can find discount coupon codes, I'm there. I'm there. Let's go on to our beautiful top five bronzers. So I think the first one that I have to mention and that I've been loving are my Fenty Beauty bronzers. Now these are called the uh, Sunstalker Instant Warm Warmth bronzers i have the shade islanding and caramel cutie i went into store to swatch these but um i know that these were the two shades i wanted caramel cutie for more when i'm a tan shade in summertime and islanding is just the best shade for me now is what i'm wearing now as well it's quite warm but i love it i literally wear it every day but once i get tan i know i can move on to caramel cutie this, so this is islanding and then we have caramel cutie here obviously you can tell i've used islanding a lot it's just so dirty right now but i love these bronzers so much but i find they work better with like goat hair bristled brushes you know those ones with the white bristles? They, they work better with those for some reason. I found that when I was using synthetic brushes, it weren't picking the product properly. Like I had to really rub in there to get the product on. But with uh, like white bristled hairs, like goat hair or something like that, it really picks it up and it blends it really nicely. So yeah, I love these. They're only like £23. I recommend these to any of you, especially for my brown skin people. Okay, do you? Just, just get it, okay? It's so nice, it's so, so nice. Now, the next one that I really do like is my Benefit Hula Caramel. They, ha I don't know what took them so long to come out with dark shades in this. Their bronzer is so nice. Um, and this shade is literally perfect for me. It's stunning. It probably doesn't look like it right now, but 
Bronzers, they might look like your skin colour when you swatch them and sometimes they might look light on your hand but once you put them on your face they're quite dark. Um, but Hula Caramel is stunning, it's very pigmented, maybe be a bit more light handed with it but it's really really nice. I think this one's a bit more pricey than the Fenty one but I do love it and will it be something that I repurchase? Yes. Could they come out with more shades? Yes, they only have like three I think so I think they definitely need to look into um, getting more shades, more tones because the formula is beautiful. The next one that I really do like which is more of a drugstore brand is from NYX obviously. I've got cat hair all over mine, just ignore that. Now the one I was usually wearing was the Deep. You could probably tell that I've used quite a lot of, um, I've hit pan and I rarely hit pan on products. But it's, again, a really nice formula. I found that it's very cool tone, the one I was wearing, the Deep. So I received one in the shade Deep Tan, which is definitely more warm and a bit more darker. So I wear this more when I'm tan. But yeah, the formula is really nice. And if you're just looking for a really good matte bronzer that's really affordable, I definitely recommend these NYX ones. They've got a beautiful formula, honestly. They blend really nice. What I really hate is bronzers that go patchy. Just go away, please. Obviously, I don't want to go too in-depth when I talk about these. I'm just sharing my favourite ones in this video. I have a bunch of tutorials where I've used these. Um, so, yeah, I'm just telling you why I like these. I just love them all for the same reasons, but you guys need to know about them. So you have your options available to you. Uh, the next one that I really like, which I've had for ages, to be honest, and I've broke, is the Topshop Bronzer in Salute. Again, a really nice warm-toned one. When I, it has a bit of red in it as well, but you don't see, I don't see it when I put it on my face. It looks really warm on me. It's like the perfect shade for me. Um, the formula is really soft and really buttery and easy to blend. And again, a bit more on the affordable side. It has really nice packaging, but I think I've, I'm really clumsy and I drop my things a hundred times. So yeah, it's just, it's, it's just didn't have luck with me, to be honest. And the last and final one is another high end, but I have to include this in it because I've had this for years, I've hit pan on it, and my sister loves it. It's a MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Dark Deep. I think my sister used Dark Deepest because she is a bit more darker than me. Um, but yeah, it's just, it's just beautiful. It's like the most beautifully blended bronzer I've ever tried, but it has a bit of a, a glow to it, but very subtle. So it makes your, in summertime, it just makes your skin look so soft and just, glowy and bronzy it's like it gives the beaut most beautiful finish and that's why i've hit pan on it and also this lasts you so long i've had this for years it doesn't even have an expiry it doesn't say how long you can use it for but i've had this for years my sister's had hers for years so i definitely recommend the mac mineralized skin finishes um dark deep could suit a lot of skin tones to be honest it is a bit more on the darker side for me i know those are five bronzers but i thought i'd have a little bonus one for you guys and um, it's the number seven caramel bronzer now their shade range is bollocks that's the word for it but but this caramel one is actually really nice it's very it's like the perfect warm tone shade um, it's not as buttery as the others, but if you're looking for an affordable bronzer and you're around my skin tone, this is not a bad one. But yeah guys, those are my top 5 bronzers with a little bonus for you guys if you want more of an affordable one. I have included some drugstore ones, but a lot of my bronzers are high end and I find they, they work really well. But if you look carefully, you can find some good drugstore ones as well that are good for people of colour. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to check out Shoptega, honestly. I wouldn't tell you this if I didn't love it myself. You would love me for it. 